win. You could lower your energy bills just by switching providers. Don't just switch off to save. Switch over. Switching is easy with Compare the Market. Download the app. Simples. Time's running out. Have you got your tickets yet? For just $2, you could win this $3.4 million prize home package as close to a Tuller Beach as you can get. Hurry, get your tickets today. Because if you win, your beachside life awaits. We begin our search in the village of Kingsley in the north of the county, around half an hour from Steve's family in Warrington. Nearby is the Anglo-Saxon town of Frodsham. Once a thriving 13th century port situated between the River Weaver and Mersey Estuary, today is a vibrant market town with a variety of independent shops, and much of the architecture is a reminder of its heritage. A few miles down the road is the village of Kingsley, and off a quiet lane in a semi-rural position is the first house we're showing them. This is where I start to find out <laughs> what you're really after. So house number one is yeah. obviously straight in front of us. What's your thoughts? I like it. Yeah, it looks nice. Oh, yeah. It looks nice. Yeah. Nice. You like the position? Yeah. It's got a bit of curve appeal, yeah. It's undergone radical renovation and extension over the last three years, but retains its character features within a modern interior. Entering via a spacious entrance hall, we're heading for the kitchen diner. Let's start off in the kitchen. Very nice. It's lovely here. Uh, exactly what yeah. we kind of go for from the, yeah. the kitchen, open plan, um, very light. Yeah. Patio doors out. This is exactly what yeah. you said, wasn't yeah. it, Annie? You said you wanted yeah, open plan, open the kitchen plan. diner, with outside. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah done it. Definitely yeah. ticks that box. Doesn't feel ultra modern, still feels like a, yeah, you know, yeah. a country house, yeah. isn't it? But yeah. It is a spare bedroom. Okay. Might be options. In the future, with mm -hmm. these outbuildings, mm -hmm. anyway. So, should we go and take a pick at those? Yeah, yeah, that's okay. great. Cool. Yeah. The grounds of the property will be the clincher. To the rear is a secluded, hedge-lined lawn garden with patio area. To the front, there's more lawn, along with plenty of off-road parking, a double garage, a barn, and paddock area. Well, someone's divided this up again for some sort of visitor attraction. This really is the extent of your land. So I know we're we're squeezing the land option for yeah. you, aren't yeah. we? You know, the house, lovely house, great. You could see us living in something like that. Yeah. Um, you know, the barns, you know, great start for something you could build on there. It's whether there's enough land and I think maybe squeezing it too much. Um, and if you put in a car park or something like that. A good barn space that you could develop. And you could probably see three or four different types of animals in there. Yeah. My main concern is around the, the land that the property comes with. It's not leaving much to develop the, the business um, in, in the future, longer term. So, see you enough? Yeah. Yeah, I think yeah. So, yeah. Starting a family isn't always easy, it takes bravery. So we've spent over 50 years evolving our science to give you the best possible chance of success. We'll leave no stone unturned to get you answers. And our team of fertility experts will be by your side. At Monash Ivy... ...will we'll breed. We're ready to show them hopefully another rare example. This time of the property variety. 